please be sure to subscribe to the channel to update the fastest and most accurate news. Hello everyone, welcome back to my journalism of the hard news channel. The story for today is the house that was the backdrop for the iconic Australian sitcom Kath Kim is being demolished. The owner, Joe Kelly, is renovating the property, which is located 35 km's southeast of Melbourne in Patterson Lakes, as she prepares to rebuild a new family home. Joe told 7 News on Monday, we are rebuilding a home that we are going to live in. It will be extremely different. It won't have any of the same brickwork, curtains or kitchen that was in the original house, she said. During the series, the property's private pier was blocked by a high fence to give the show a more suburban feel. It has since been torn down. In 2005, stars and creators of the series, Gina Riley and Jane Turner, spoke to The Age about transforming the house into Kath and Kim's humble home. The house gave us information, Jane said, with Gina adding, yes, we had never written in the script about the good room or the kitchen. But once we got the house, all that just happened. That sliding door, from the backyard to the family room, is like an entrance, a theatrical entrance. Those sorts of things were just so fantastic to use, the entrance always seems so theatrical to me, but also really real, she said. The property was sold in 2011 for $1.23 million and then it again in 2014 for $1.3 In the show, their home was located in the fictional suburb of Fountain Lakes. It comes after it was revealed that the beloved Australian sitcom could be getting a reboot 20 years after it first hit screens. The show, which aired on the ABC and Channel 7 from 2002 to 2007, will make a return next year, according to Woman's Day. The Melbourne home that was used as the central location for the series has been visited by crew members in recent weeks, neighbours say. It was unimaginable neighbours could keep TV's biggest secret under wraps much longer, a source told the magazine. The Kath Kim reboot is already in pre-production and is expected to air on a streaming platform, not a free-to-air TV channel. An official announcement will be made later this month, Woman's Day reports. The series also spawned the television movie Da Kath Kim Code in 2005 and the feature film Kath Kimderella in 2012. That is all for today news, please make sure to leave your comment and subscribe the channel below for more news update. Thank you for watching.